Well, what do you think? It was a lot of fun. You know, we've, all of us, I think there was 17 of us out here today that have been, you know, we, we kind of, we've been growing up together as teammates over the past few years, and for us to see all our hard work culminate in today was a lot of fun. I think, you know, um, however the workout turns out, it's fun to, it's fun to be out here with, with my teammates to, uh, to sort of, you know, work towards achieving our dreams. How satisfied are you with your performance? I think we had a good day. Um, you know, the, all the timing and all that, I'm not necessarily sure how I did, but, but throwing-wise, Coach Jones did a heck of a job preparing me. So, uh, our receivers make some great catches to uh, to save a couple of completions. So we, we had we had a good day out there. It was it was fun. And again, you know, can't say enough about how how, how much Coach Jones did to, to prepare me for this and to, and, uh, to get the wideouts out there every day. Those guys, along with their training, were out there putting in putting in two a days with me to, to get ready for this throwing performance. So that was uh, it was fun and uh, really really uh, want to thank those guys. Did you get any feedback from any scouts or teams? Um, I haven't talked to anyone much yet. Um, you know, hopefully after this, as, as, as guys are leaving, get a, get a couple phone numbers or cards or whatever it may be, and, and, and then, you know, see what the next step is. I'm still unsure as to how this, you know, this whole process is going to work going forward and, and don't really have any idea of exactly what's going to happen next. But, uh, again, I'm excited about it and, um, and uh, really enjoyed today. Can you just talk about the long journey it's taken me to get here from the surgeries and from Texas to here and finally this day? I tell you what, it's uh, it, it's it's been quite the uh, the roller coaster of, of a college career, and um, you know, again, I, I can't thank Coach Jones enough for for giving me first of all giving me an opportunity to, to continue playing playing football um, two years ago, um, and, and just these guys on this team who welcomed me in and let me be their be their quarterback, be their leader. Um, it, it's really been these past two years have been wonderful for me, and, and to give me to you know. To give me a chance to to try and chase to chase my dream and my goal now for becoming an NFL player. How's the training for today different than training for games on a week to week uh, basis just, during the season? I'll tell you what, I'm glad I won't ever have to run a 40 yard dash again. Um, just you know, it uh, and and you know, understanding that stuff's all important and, and you have to you have to that, that's part of it and that's part of what we're testing on the 40 yard dash, the 5 10 5, the vertical and the broad jump, but. Uh, I don't necessarily view those things as my strong suit on the football field, so uh, I'm just I'm glad that part of it's over and get back to training for for on the field activities. You kind of been in a spotlight since 10th, 11th grade before you went to, then on to UT, University of Texas. Today you're basically auditioning for potential employers. Are there any nerves involved on a day like today? A little bit. It's 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 kind of like game day. Um, you know, we've all been working basically our entire off season for this day. And so I don't think it would be right if there weren't any nerves. Um, a lot of excitement, um, you know, it, it's going out there to throw, just, you know, to do what I do, to do what I've been doing, playing this game for, for you know, 12 to 13 years is, is throwing the football around. So just to be able to come out and do that, uh, it really was a lot of fun. Any difference throwing the NFL ball compared to the college ball? Yeah, I like it a lot better. Uh, those Wilson balls are a lot easier to throw, a little, little bit easier to spin. Your dad was in the NFL for years. What kind of advice did he give you as you've finished your college career and started getting ready for this? My dad's always been my coach. Um, anytime I needed anything, uh, he's been there. You know, the, pro, the, the, the spectacle of a pro day, I think, has changed quite a bit since he was in college, so not really sure how much advice he could give me in regards to this. But at the same time, you know, anytime I need anything, if I have a question, uh, he knows the game so well, having been there and done it at the highest level. He knows a lot of people in this business, and and having having him uh, around is uh, you really can't measure how much how much of a help he's been throughout my life and how much he's given me in terms of the game of football on and off the field. You said you didn't really get feedback from the scouts, but your agent Lee Steinberg was here today. What has he told you about what teams have been saying to him? He's been awesome. He's been another guy that I've been so glad to have in my corner and. Um, you know, he's kind of told me this is where his job begins of, of sort of getting the word out, trying to create a little bit of a buzz uh, going forward into the next month so that uh, we can be as, you know, as knowledgeable about where I stand uh, come, come May uh, as possible. One more. This is the last time you get a chance to, you know, throw in front of scouts. Do you think you did enough today to turn some heads? You know, I feel like I did uh, everything I could do. Um, I was, uh, I felt like I prepared as hard as I possibly could for this. And, and you know, I think, like I said, uh, Coach Jones did a heck of a job preparing me. My receivers did a heck of a job putting in the actual work for me to, to, to have this day. And, and, you know, I think we did a great job. And, and I really am looking forward to seeing and hearing what, uh, what, uh, what the, some of the feedback going forward.